Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Kaisa. So I know I haven't been posting Zumba videos for quite a while and this is going to be a video just going to catch up with me plus teaching you how to make El Pollo Loco Bowl by scratch. And if you are interested, I could link down below the recipe if you guys are wanting to know like how you did it Kaisa and guess what? Guess what? It's oil free because God knows like what's in the free hole is and Rice probably they cook it with oil a little lot and you don't want to want to know like eat. So yeah, I'm very sensitive. I have a sensitive gut and when I do consume oil like I get extremely like bloated and I feel fatigue and you know we all learn so I learned that and I realized that like when I do consume oils like I can't and I have a huge reaction, even includes with breakout like well right now because I am because like I'm on it so what I mean by on it because I'm on my period at this very moment so sometimes I get it before between or after it's weird but hey everybody's different but it's my body so yeah I'll teach you and at the same time I am doing what I gotta do I've been chit chatting with you catching up with you guys and like you know chit chat let's talk yeah I'm right here chopping broccoli Every time I do a pour, uh, order El Pollo Loco uh, ball, I always have a side over uh, of broccoli just because I want to get my greens, all right? Just saying, okay? So that's why I'm adding up broccoli. For those who don't like because like it makes you gassy, whatever, and stuff, well, yo, you do you, I do myself. I'm good. <laughs> but yeah, um... Yeah, so where have I been up to? Um, here and there. All of a sudden, let me tell you something. I got a third job, and it was unexpected. It seems like a fourth job is coming along. Uh, I'm not sure I'm able to handle it, so that's why I haven't submitted my video as soon as possible as I can. It was unexpected, and I'm just here like trying to help out my friend. Her name is Cynthia. She's the owner of uh, La Madre Terea, which I will leave the link below. She is my friend. She's very sweet, kind. Yo, she is, okay? Deep inside she is. She's very sweet. I love her. And I'm glad I have my hair. She gave me this opportunity. And I thought my brother was going to get it. But ironically, no. And I was... It was actually the opposite. I was trying to hook up my brother. And uh, no, it didn't work out. So, you know, things happen. And, like, just take advantage about it. And go from there. And so far, I have to say, I love it. It reminds me so much in culinary art class because, yes, uh, yo, your girl did took a uh, culinary art class and I miss it so much. Hold on. I, I love it. It's such a relief to just do this and I'm like actually like a chef, I guess, like a line proof chef, I guess. But yeah. Damn, I look like a mess. For real. I think I'm going to put my hair down. <laughs> Hold up. I think I look cute either way, so yeah. <laughs> yeah, um, the reason why my hair was up because right before when I decided to cook, I was doing body combat, so I need to get my hair up, all right? So no messy hair going up, down, like I'd be like sweeping, like I don't need to deal with that stuff. And my hair is growing, so it was short, short, but now it's like, woohoo! <laughs> Just here dealing with school. For those who don't know, I am a student of Institute of Integrative Nutrition as a health coach and future holistic nutrition and also at Chafee College. Chafee put that out. Actually, it's Mount Sac. I always had that mind that like, okay, I'm here in Chafee, but not. I'm actually a Mount Sac student. Was though. I was Chafee. Growing up my business, which later on, I'm going to share that with all my family and friends who are interested and willing to support me. I need a lot of support, no joke. It's not as that easy to grow a business. Just like that, like, you need a lot of support. Very soon, my website is coming out too. It's already on process, also my business card. So I'm really excited and um, my parents doesn't know this, but once it's out, I think they're gonna find out because they subscribe me, of course. That's what parents are about, right? Isn't that beautiful? Well, I do hope my dad is, but I know my mom for sure is. But yeah, um, we'll probably, probably we'll give you a little bit of hint of regarding my business. It's basically putting out, like, since I'm studying as a health coach and holistic nutrition, health coach is like about um, supporting and helping people out 
it could be physically, mentally, spiritually, career, uh, financial, uh, relationship, health, fitness, like anything. Like I'm telling you, it's like you're talking to a psychiatrist. Basically, even though I'm not licensed or like psychologist, it's somewhat because we are here as a listener and. Since I was little, I knew this was something what I wanted to do. I just didn't know what was the name. I didn't even know there was a session called Health Coach. So I was like, that's interesting. So once when I took it, uh, I checked it out and I was like, this was meant to be. <laughs> yeah, so it's like, I I'm really am a good listener and uh, I, I love listening to people's story too because like everybody has their own story and the way I see it is that it's nice to know like where they're coming from and so you could respect them because a lot of people they just say stuff when it could uh, you don't know by your words you may put their self-esteem down and it's not right you gotta understand where they're coming from too that how the way they're raised that's why they have this kind of behavior this attitude and we're all different and the that shows like we're all different and that's the beautiful part but here it goes <laughs> um if you're interested you could email me uh, to work 101 so what it goes is like this once when you email me I will send you a form that's called a health history you fill that out and you forward uh, back to me so I will print it out once when I had to print it out I would uh, call you or text you whatever is convenient for you or email you um, saying that what are the days that for you um, and me having a 45 minute or it could be 45, 50 or an hour to talk about what is the form that you have wrought, wrought down, uh, write down, uh, past, present, okay geez, you know what I mean, anyway. <laughs> Um, yeah, so we're gonna go from there. So f my job is just to understand where you're coming from. Once when I understand where you're coming from and you like what I how I work, I could share with you my six month program. And the six month program includes um, my fitness program. So like since I'm a Zumba, I'm very soon body combat and I'm also creating my own fitness program that's called Simple Fitness. Um, I will provide that to you. If you're world if you're um, not local and you're out of town and so you're thinking like how can I get my fitness? Well that's why I'm a YouTuber as being as a, a Zumba instructor posting out my videos out there and um yeah, that's like part of getting your fitness. So like, let's say if you're concerned that like you want to lose weight, but you don't know how to. So that's what I'm here for, to help you, to support you, motivate you. You know, you said this, but you, you really are doing it. So I'm always going to be there like 24-7, making sure I will text you randomly like, all right, FaceTime me right now if you really are doing it. You know, it's like literally like that. You know me? And I will leave down below a link to my email address so you can have access. Yep, that's what I'm doing. As a health coach, just raise a tomato. And as a holistic nutrition, I do provide also nutrition part of the program too. So like, let's say you want to lose weight or uh, there's a specific diet that you want to try out or whatever. Vegan or non-vegan, vegetarian, non-vegetarian, paleo diet, whatever is out there that you're wanting to try out, I always have to question to you, like, why is that? Because, like, you know, now here's a trend right here in uh, in California, probably now like worldwide. I could be wrong. I don't know, but um, yeah, um, vegan is the thing right now, and I'm not vegan just because like everybody is. I was like right before that, so it's like. I did it at first health and knowing afterwards about my action like oh I'm doing for the animals I was like then I was doing for the animals I was like oh my gosh it's just so sad like how people hurt uh, creatures like that and they have feelings so it's like come on I, I can't do that so that's why I haven't ate meat 
anything regarding with animal products, no. Not in my gut, I'm sorry, I can't. And besides, I do have a, a huge reaction too. Like, example, when I do consume all red meat, which was years ago, um, I get really bloated and um, constipated. It's not as pretty, so. Always uh, be alert, like, to your own self and listen to your body. A lot of people, they don't do that. They just eat because of taste. But it's not about that. It's about listening and seeing from there. Probably that's why you're ill. So that's another thing, part of us, the program of help coach is that you know how everybody's being obese right now they have diabetes cancer uh so much you know out there there's so much element that people suffer uh thyroid disease adhd there's always a cause of it and once when you find out it's like heartbreaking like what it's sad but um my action is that to help out and like not have finding the cure for it but just to show that what you eat may heal so it just point out there there's even statistic if you go vegan but I'm not here to um, push, push it out to my client no if they don't want to it's fine they can live without chicken you do you but also think about it, it's your life and your life matters. So that's what I'm trying to point out there. Um, when it comes to nutrition, just be careful of uh, what you eat. So I'm here to be there for anybody. So if you know somebody needs help when it comes to losing weight or wants to eat healthy, wants to have a healthy lifestyle, but they're not financially, they're not okay. Uh, like it's putting them down, they need help whatever like it could be relationship problems whatever it is out there I'm I'm here like to have a talk and I could solve your problem uh, it's about helping too that's what I do so yeah I do it for fun um, for those who don't know me I'm a really caring person I really am that's why before I was a nurse but I was like but I don't see it as a nurse, like, I don't know, I could be wrong, but I just, um, no, physically, I really want to see it, that's the difference, I want to see it in front of me, that I'm making change, like, changing their life, that's what I want, little by little, I want to do that, not just, like, helping, like, but I want to take action, that's the difference, I'm going to take action because here, I'm dripping of tomato juice right here. But uh, yeah, um, that's what I want to do really bad. So yeah, I'm on it. I'm almost like halfway done. <sighs> yeah, so that is the business out there. I'm trying to like point out for everybody. So yeah, if you are interested, you want to work out with me once again, you know, just email me. If you have my number, text me. Don't be shy. I don't bite. <laughs> Let me look at my beans, give me a moment. Sorry for the moment. I just put that inside because I felt uncomfortable knowing that my mother's coming and going to listen to my conversation. Like, who are you talking to? Are you okay? I'm like, no, I am cool. <laughs> it's just, don't you get awkward? Like, as a YouTuber, all right? Like, I need more space. <laughs> but yeah. Um, all right, beans are ready. Broccoli, so, 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 so. Hold up, testing time. All right, broccoli is almost ready. Now I'm just chopping to make pico de gallo. This beautiful bowl for sunning. Okay. <laughs> and yeah, so like meantime when I am like cooking, I like to play some music to get my, you know, getting pumped up. Hey, just kidding. <laughs> no, but for real, I mean like, I think with life without music would be pretty odd for me. Can't live without music. Music has like a lot of meaning to it and it just like express how the way you feel and you can share it to your friends or like some other people to have you to understand like where you're coming from just music isn't that beautiful express yourself anything regarding with art it's beautiful 
Oh yeah, and also when I do order a pollo bowl, I always say no chicken. Well, when I used to. Uh, I always say no chicken and a substitute with avocado on top and extra rice because, yo, I need my carbs. And for those who are scared of carbs because it makes you fat, dude, that's just a myth. Like, myth. Uh, don't believe it. Do your own research and figure out for your own self. That's the whole point about the media right now. They just plan it out to just brainwash you. There's a lot of propaganda out there, so do not believe it. Trust me, don't. Alright, right now it's time to serve. So here is the Mexican rice. Here's El Pollo Loco. Oh. Five dollar or so. Especially when you do add the broccoli. Oops, here's the <laughs> sorry. Uh, when you add a side of broccoli, it charges you like a dollar or fifty cents. So, depending also your area. Yeah, so this is how I order. So I did it for me, for my parents, and I bet they're gonna be impressed because yo, this is pretty rare when this happens when I do this. But yeah. Yeah, so if you want Oops, that's J Lo. <laughs> uh blame to Pandora. I'm gonna be honest, like every time when you click on a radio station that you want, it's just like other songs that it's not even the song that you do expect. But yeah, I click on Britney Spears because just because uh <laughs> um because I like her music, okay? So don't make fun of me. Actually, a long time ago, I was bullied. Uh, long story to share about that. Back when I was, what, elementary school. Yeah, that was way back then. Was like, you know, the Backstreet Boys and sing. Yeah, that's how, you don't even want to know how old I am. <laughs> but yeah, so that was a Pollo Loco Bowl. You're welcome. If you want the recipe, I'll link down below. Um, other than that, have a great day and once again thank you for following for those who are following me and supporting me all right before i end this i was so close oh look at that look at i was about to end this without not even showing you guys like what's my opinion toward this because this is my first attempt doing this so let's do this Dang, there's a Cheerios box right on top of me do i eat Cheerios? no i don't my parents do uh when i do consume like um uh, well, a lot of processed food, I do get breakouts. So, here it goes. Here's beans with a little bit of rice. Can you see? Can you see? Hey, that's sexy. Mm. It's really good. It's actually on point. That's so weird. Okay. So normally, like I said, I usually order a pollo loco bowl. No chicken. Adding extra rice. Yo. Tastes good. And you see what? There you go. I'm so good. <laughs>